الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم اما بعد بكى سفيان الثوري رحمه الله تعالى ليلة الصباح فلما اصبح قيل له كل هذا خوف من الذنوب فاخذ تبنات من الارض وقال ذنوب اهون من هذا وانما ابكي من خوف الخاتمه سفيان الثوري رحمه الله تعالى was crying from the night until the morning and when the, it reached the morning it was said to him is that from your fear of sins and then he grabbed a handful of dirt and he said sins are lighter than this he said verily I cry because I'm fear of how I will end Qala Ibn Qayyum rahimahullah ta'ala in response to this or related to this narration he said wa hadha a'zam وَهَذَا مِنْ أَعْظَمَ الْفِقْ أَنْ يَخَافُ الرَّجِلْ أَنْ تَخْذَ لَهُ ذُنُوبُهُ عِنْدَ الْمَوْتِ فَتَحَوُلْ بَيْنَهُ وَبَيْنَ الْخَاتِمَةِ الْحُسْنَةِ Ibn al-Qayyim رحمه الله تعالى said in relation to that athar of Sufyan al-Thawri he said, and that is from the greatest of understanding or the greatest fiqh. And that is that a man would fear that his sins would deceive him when he dies. And that it would come between him and having a righteous ending. Ahabatifillah, that is fiqh. That is great understanding of the religion and understanding that our sins can overcome us. Never believe that you are just saved as some of the people of false identity, believing that they're believers and believing with arrogance that they are saved from the fire. Never become arrogant because we don't know how we will end. We don't know in which state we will die. And this is in a conjunction or in relation to the hadith of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam who said, وَإِنَّ أَحَدَكُمْ لِيَعْمَلَ بِعَمَلَ أَهْلَ الْجَنَّةِ حَتَّ مَا يَكُونَ بَيْنَهُ وَبَيْنَهَا إِلَى ذِرَاعًا فَيُسْبِكُوا عَلَيْهِ الْكِتَابِ فَيَعْمَلَ بِعَمَلَ أَهْلَ النَّارِ فَيُدْخِلُهَا The Prophet Alaihi Salatu Wasallam said, Verily one of you will do the deeds of the paradise, do the deeds of paradise, deeds that will get you into paradise, righteous deeds, until what is between him and it, meaning him in paradise, is an arm span length. And then what was written will overtake him, he will do the deeds of the hellfire and enter it. So none of us know. And this is why for the mu'min, it is upon him or her to constantly do good deeds. And do deeds even after you've done a sin. When you are in sin that you will know you're doing, you know you're doing something wrong, then try to do some charity. Try to do something nice, something good that will help to expiate some of that ma'asi and the noob. And likewise, never become arrogant. Strive your best to continue to do good deeds and never think that you are saved. وَعِيَاذٍ بِاللَّهِ مِنْ خُذْلَانٍ And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. I'm here in Addis Ababa, in the capital of Ethiopia, and make dua for us that Allah will bless us to go forward and do positive, 
bless us with ilm al-nafi, ruskin tayyib, wa amal al-mutakabbilin. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.